Nicola Badalana from PixieHill.com with a terrible head cold and a walkthrough for Gypsy Soul Laser Cuts. Today I'm putting together the little bathing machine from Gypsy Soul. Begin by assembling the base. Be sure that the two side pieces match, mirroring one another. Next, the sides and one of the end pieces are added. I'm leaving one end off to make embellishing easier. The little set of stairs is next. I'm covering just about everything in a healthy coat of black acrylic paint. I'm using wax paper underneath so that the delicate wheel spokes don't stick to the surface below. These two long rectangles will make the roof. I'm prepping those too. I'll be using dark paper to cover this piece and painting the edges dark will help to camouflage any uneven edges or gaps. I've pre-cut paper to cover this project, the floor and walls. I'm also covering the last wall. Notice that I am not covering the tabs on the sides. This will ensure that the piece fits comfortably when assembled. I did not pre-cut the windows. Instead, I'll cut those out now and sand with a nail file for a perfect fit. The last wall is glued into place. Now the exterior. I'll paper, cut and sand. Decorate the small door piece. 
If you like to include shutters, you can cut the window pieces in half, paint them black, and decorate them to match your project. I want to darken the paper I'm using, so I'm applying a wash of black paint. This is just black acrylic paint that has been diluted with water. Now to add some trims. I've cut two pieces of doweling to apply to either side as handles. A drop of instant glue and a bead cap are applied to the end. Glue the two roof pieces together. Once the glue has set, apply chipboard shingles in layers. Begin from the bottom edge and work towards the peak. I am awful at applying hinges, so my door will be glued ajar. If you are doing the same, make sure that it sits in a position that doesn't get in the way of those little steps. Once your shingles are dry, trim the extra length. Then paint to match your project. You can add some moss if you like. Perhaps some flowers to match the decor. And more exterior embellishments. For the chimney pipes, I've simply cut a paper straw to match the pitch of the roof and painted it black. Finally, I'm adding a wee table with a crystal ball that can be seen through the windows. And there it is, my quirky little bathing machine for creepy beachgoers. 
And by all means, if creepy isn't your thing, make something elegant. The important thing is to make and create and keep on making. Check out the link in the video description for the full supply list and, as always, if you make your own beautiful version of this project, tag the heck out of me. I love to see the amazing things you create.